Andrew Allegretti here for day number two of Virginia Tech's Fall Camp 2013 here with linebacker Jack Tyler. Jack, let's get right into it. What do you see as the potential for this defense this year? Uh, I think the sky's the limit. Um, we have the talent. We have the coaching. Uh, you know, a lot like last year, we just have to execute. Um, we have to get rid of those big plays that we were um, suffering a lot of last year. We have to get rid of the mental mistakes. But um, like I said, we have the talent. We have the coaching. Um, we could be the number one team in the, or number one defense in the country if we want to be. We just have to get there. Do you think things will be different for you at all this year, considering that you had some second team all ACC honors last year? Do you think offenses might be saying, oh, we want to make sure we know where 58 is on the field? Do you think things will be different for you out there? Yeah, you know, I think, uh, you know, teams will definitely scheme to block me a little bit better. But um, for the most part, you know, I'm going to do the same thing I did last year. I'm going to um, try, try to make plays, try to get off blocks, um, you know, just try to be a force out there. Um, you know, I have great confidence in myself that I can be, uh, you know, top linebacker. Um, and, uh, you know, I just have to go out there and do it. Is that anything the coaches have talked to you about? Not really. I mean, they just they their expectations don't change from player to player. Um, they expect me to go out and run this defense. They expect me to be the leader of the defense. Um, you know what comes every week. You know that we'll see. But um, they expect me that even if I'm getting you know blocked by five guys, that I have to go make a play. Um, that's just their expectations. What's the value to this defense to have a healthy Tariq Edwards out there? Oh, he means so much. Um, you know, just another senior leader out there too. Um, you know, he's a really good, really vocal guy. Um, just good with the younger guys, um, getting them going. Um, but also he's a good playmaker for us. He makes a lot of plays when we need him to. And um, he's a little bit of a guy, a guy with experience that he's been playing before. Um, he's just a good senior leader out there that we need. All right, so you brought up some of the younger guys. How about a quick uh, overview of maybe the two young guys that have a shot to get out on the field right away, Kendall Fuller and Brandon Faison? Yeah, I mean, both are really good players. We've seen a little bit of them um, just through summer and today. Um, but, you know, like, who, who, really it's just it's up for grabs. You know, we have a lot of guys that are um, fighting for that position. Um, and really it's just who's going to take the position. Um, you know, whoever plays well, I know Coach Foster and Coach Gray, they're going to make the decision of whoever's best for the team. And, um, you know, all those players, are they're definitely quality players, and they can all get it done. They can all play at this level. Um, you know, there's just going to be whoever comes out on top.